Welcome back to the series. We're going to be testing top rated face mask sold on Amazon. Today we have a K95. This is the WW Doll K95. We're also going to be testing kids K95 or respirators. So if you guys have any requests, please make sure to leave them down below. So let's go ahead and jump into the listing before we open the bag. This is the WW Dog Kids K95 face mask pack of 25 and this is a 5 layer breathable K95 mask for children. This is in the color black. They are being sold by the actual manufacturers. They currently have a 4.5 out of 5 rating. So let's go ahead and open the bag now. So they come packed in 5s. It also comes with a certificate of conformity. So let's take one out. So this is how it looks. This is how it looks from the inside. Let's go ahead and put it on my face and we can talk more about it while I'm putting it on. I think it's a really good idea that it has adjustable straps. I don't feel like it doesn't fit me properly, but these are considered kids face masks, so the sizing could be a little different. It doesn't have the best nose wire, but since it does have a nose foam, it's a bit more comfortable, so which is good for kids. These are a little more on the thicker side, so I am struggling to breathe a little bit because they are a bit thicker, but we're going to see how the breathability does on our TSI machine. So with that being said, let's go ahead and see how they test on our TSI machine. We're going to see the filtration along with the pressure drop. This is our TSI machine model 8130A, which is the same filtration testing machine that NIOSH uses to certify N95 respirators. We first start off by removing the headband from the mask before placing it onto the testing plate to ensure a proper seal. Then, we make sure that the mask is completely sealed with hot glue to the testing plate. The testing plate is then attached to the frame and the box is placed under the TSI filter holder for testing. Let's go over the results. F stands for air flow rate, which we test at 85 liters per minute. R is for resistance, also referred to as pressure drop. This correlates with the breathability. So the lower the number, the more comfortable and breathable the mask is. E stands for filtration efficiency percentage. As shown, filtration percentage for all three samples was 98.37% or higher. As you guys saw from the TSI results, all of the three samples that we tested passed the filtration and the lowest filtration percentage was a 98.56, which is a really good percentage when it comes to K95s. As I mentioned earlier, I did feel like these face masks are a bit on the thicker side and according to our pressure drop, most of them tested at 18 millimeters of water and above, which are on the higher side when it comes to K95s or N95. So these aren't the most breathable K95. And I don't know if I would recommend these specifically because since they are claiming to be for kids, face masks for kids should be a lot more comfortable and breathable. Overall, when it comes to the filtration efficiency, they did pass and comfort of these are pretty good. But because of the breathability, we wouldn't be able to recommend these. I hope that you guys found this video helpful. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and also comment down below your feedback when it comes to these face masks if you guys have bought this for your kids. We will also have a lot of important information in the description box down below, which include our website, which is acumen.com, and our master data sheet, so please make sure to check that out. And I'll see you guys in the next video.